Hi there, stampers and crafters. My name is Tammy White from stampwithtammy.com, and today I'm going to share lots of excitement with you guys. Today is a viewer's choice day. I'm going to be sharing a bunch of swap cards that I got at the most recent on stage live event in Salt Lake City, Utah. Some awesome, awesome cards I picked. I have, I don't know, probably a hundred swap cards here. I picked some of my favorites and you guys can pick your favorites and I'll make a how-to video out of the most popular choices. Also, this is the second video in my on-stage tote giveaway, so stay tuned to the end and I'll give you some quick details on how to enter that giveaway twice. Don't forget, the Stampin' Up! retirement list has been released and some of these items have already started selling out. Just a heads up. They're only available until May 31st or while supplies last and when they're gone, they're gone. And just a heads up, I'm going to be offline for a couple of weeks in May for a vacation at the end of this annual catalog. My blog will still be posting every day, I just won't be doing videos. And I'll be back the beginning of June with a whole new season and a whole new catalog and all kinds of new fun. So I'll remind you as we get a little closer. All right, let's check out some of these awesome swaps. For each of these cards, I wrote a little list of their main stamp sets and noted which ones were on the retiring list, just so you'll know the must-haves. This is a beautiful triple step stamping card. It uses the sheltering tree, holly jolly greeting, something to say and trust God. And the something to say and trust God stamp sets are on the retiring list. Love this technique. Absolutely gorgeous. There is a YouTube video on my blog and we periscope this technique. If you search for it on my stampwithtammy.com blog, you'll find that. And next we have this beautiful card from my friend Jane Replia. This uses the flower shop stamp set. And I love how she made a bouquet, just cutting little strips of the black paper here. And she used clear embossing. I'm just gonna move it so you can see how shiny they are. It's such a wow. And these little leaves on the back are from the bird punch. And just a note, that bird punch is on the retiring list. And this is another beautiful card from my friend Jane Replia. Now this one, she added these little embellishments. It's a little sand dollar and a little starfish, which are extras. These are these are not something that are in the catalog, but love what she did with this turtle. She embossed him, and then he's watercolored underneath. And this is watercolor paper that she watercolored on. Just beautiful, beautiful. And then the background here is the, from the Tide stamp set that is retiring. And the Journey Begin comes from the beautiful ride stamp set, which is the, the punch buggy in the occasions catalog. And that one's retiring too. Loved, loved this card. So very fun. This next card is from the Grateful Bunch stamp set. Love the flowers on this card, but that is not the only wow here. This card, Z Fold. <laughs> How fun is that? Very, very cool. Next up, we have the Garden in Bloom flower here. This background paper, beautiful. This is the English Garden background paper and the paper is retiring. This, the stamp set will be in the new catalog and it's got some Wink of Stella on the background there just to really make it pop. Beautiful card. These tea lace doilies are also retiring. I love these and I use them a lot. So if those are something that you use a lot, you might want to stock up on them before they're gone. Next on the list is the Zoo Babies card and not only is the stamp set retiring, but all of these colors that each of the animals are stamped in are the retiring in colors. The Blackberry Bliss, the Lost Lagoon, the Mossy Meadow. Just awesome colors. Really sad to see them go. If you like this card, everything on it, you might want to get over to the online store fast <laughs> before they go. And here's another great card. This is from the Buy the Tide stamp set, which is also retiring. Love this lobster. Very, very sad to see him go, especially being from New England. He's kind of an icon here. <laughs> But this was just such a simple card, and it's a wow. The stamp set is really just collage stamped on, on a single layer of very vanilla. Just a beautiful, beautiful card. And next up, this one I was surprised to see on the retiring list. This is the Going Global stamp set. It's in the Occasions catalog. I've done quite a few ideas with this one on my stampwithtammy.com blog. But here's another great card. It's got the world map background and the globe in the center. You mean the world to me. Love it. And here is another stamp set retiring from the Occasions catalog. This one we knew about. It's a hostess stamp set. They don't carry over. It's a very hard to get hostess stamp set. I've given this away a couple of times in giveaways because it's so popular. It's the Love You 
so S-E-W <laughs> card. And I love when everybody responds to those giveaways with comments. They're always like, I so S-E-W want to win. <laughs> but you can also get this one free if you host a workshop, if you're in my stamp club and are a hostess, or if you have a large order, if you and your friends combine a large order to $150, you can get this set free. And it's a really fun one. And I love what she did here with the baker's twine. Wrapped it around the little spool there. Just very, very fun and cool card for you sewer freaks out there. And for those of you who have friends that are sewers and quilters. This next card is from Gorgeous Grunge and the Butterfly Punch. Just beautiful. Love, love. And you could swap out colors for different colors here and get the same awesome effect. It's stamped with the Gorgeous Grunge in the background. And then the Butterfly Punch was punched out and just sponged with the same color. And then some rhinestones on top. Awesome. You will be happy to know Gorgeous Grunch is not retiring in this catalog. Whew, <laughs> that one will be in the new catalog. This one, however, will not be. This is the Summer Silhouette stamp set. My friend Susan Adams made this. I'm gonna show you a close up. It's a masked single layer right here. Beautiful, beautiful card. Don't forget to let me know which ones are your favorite. This one ranks up there for, as one of mine. It's a simple card, it's easy, and it's awesome. It's just such a wow. I love the, the white and the black together on the Sahara sand. It's just a beautiful combination. So next up, I have a few cards from the Your Sublime stamp set. And you can't go wrong with Google Eyes because they're so much fun. Look at this little frog. You just want to play with him because his little eyes are just like all wonky and funny. And Oh, he's totally awesome. You'll be happy to know Your Sublime is carrying over into the new catalog, which is awesome. And my Stamp It Demonstrator group, we just put out a new card tutorial. Um, so if you're in my demonstrator group, you can get that free on our Facebook page. If you're not in my demonstrator group, you can contact me and I can tell you how to get there. <laughs> and here's another one with the submarine. Very fun. You can either use the epoxy dots or crystal effects for this little submarine window. I got to kind of hold it at an angle so you can see it on the video. So cool. Very fun submarine card. All right. One more from this stamp set another googly eyes just love him have a snappy day so stinking cute love the crab love the google eyes too stinking cute okay this card is absolutely breathtaking gorgeous wow this is from it's a, it's there's three main stamp sets on here the timeless treasures petite petals and a dozen thoughts which is the words that the words are retiring the other two stamp sets will carry over Elegant eggplant and very vanilla here. The tea lace doily colored in the elegant eggplant. Mwah, love it with a little metallic silver. Just beautiful card. Love the vintage texturing. I'm just going to hold it up a little closer so you can see the wow in there. Awesome. Next, I have a couple of cards here from the Picture Perfect stamp set. You'll know this stamp set in the Occasions catalog because it has the hummingbird in it and the starfish, and it's a multi-stepper, beautiful set. Great, great ideas from this. I've done a few videos using this set and just love it. Love this starfish card so much. This, this stamp set is carrying over into the new catalog. And here's one more card from this stamp set, this one from my friend Patty Bennett beautiful again using the metallic doily in the back this bottom lace is a designer paper this is the this is the timeless elegance designer paper i've done quite a bit with it it's one of my favorite papers that is retiring in fact i do expect that to sell out fairly quickly it was still available this morning when i made the video but i can't say that it will be available for too much longer because it's just so popular and so amazing i will have the retirement list on my stampwithtammy.com blog if you just click over to this project page, the link will be there. This one's really fun. So it's from the stamp set, Hey Girl, which it always reminds me of those memes you see, the hot guy going, Hey Girl. <laughs> oh, insert rest of quote here, but just love this little Scotty dog. So cute. This stamp set is retiring, sadly. It, it is going the other stamp sets on this card, kind of eclectic, sheltering tree sprinkles of life and crazy about you will be carrying over, but the little doggy who makes the whole card, he's retiring. So very, very cute idea there with the little Scotty dog. 
Okay, next up, I have a collection here. This is very, very fun. My friend Janet Baker made them. They're a little set from the Playful Pals bundle. This bundle is carrying over and I just love it. It's definitely one of my favorites. So this one's the elephant, yay you. And next in the set is the little piggy. Absolutely love him. So, so stinking cute. And last up in this collection is the little frog. Look at the little tongue. How cute is that? So flippin' adorable. Love it. And wait, those three were from Janet Baker. This one is from my friend Michelle Beasley. She's also in the Stampa Demonstrator group. Freaking love this one. So cute. The moose from the Playful Pals. Look at his little paws and his little tail. He's hanging out from behind his little sign because he's a party animal. Oh, good times. We all love a good party animal. <laughs> oh, so adorbs. So adorbs. Okay, I have two more awesome wow cards to show you. Both of them I had periscoped on different occasions from the actual onstage event. This is one I showed live from the event because it was just such a wow when I got it. Love that it's lemonade made from vellum. So this is definitely one of my favorites. I know when I periscoped it, everybody was like, can we make it? So definitely... We'll probably have to put this on the list of things to make because it's just awesome and I love it and I want to make it. And lastly, the Instagram card. Again, Periscope this whole thing because my friend Cindy Clark made this and she was carrying a little printer in her pocketbook. It printed little Polaroid pictures, but instead of a Polaroid camera, you took the picture with your smartphone, sent it over to the printer in a, in a heartbeat, and then she was putting them in her swap cards. So this is me and my mom at OnStage. And then Cindy made this Instagram card out of punches and just amazing. And the, and the hashtag OS16 is for OnStage16, which was Stampin' Up's convention. And love, love, love this card. Love Cindy. Taking swaps to a new level. That's my 25 cards. Now I'll show you that giveaway and how you can enter it. All right, it's giveaway time. So. I'm giving away my on-stage tote bag and what's in it is as exciting as the tote itself. Here's what's in it. I have an assortment of cardstock in the brand new ink colors and you can see my sneak peek video to see these up close. They're beautiful. As well as a pack of brand new ink color markers and a designer paper stack with the playful palette. Again, you can see these up close in my sneak peek video and you can also enter to win this giveaway both by leaving a comment on this video's project page by clicking on this video, clicking in the link below, and or <laughs> you can also enter to win on my sneak peek video that I put out on Thursday. Two chances you can enter once per blog post. Good luck entering the contest and thanks for joining me today.